welcome back. We're on commitment number five of five, and that is getting regular diagnostic checkups. I'm so committed to all these choices that I've made on a day-to-day -day in my health, in my life, that it's really important for me to get confirmation that I'm really on the right track. And to do that, I do a couple things. First thing is that I make sure that I get blood work at least one time of year. I want to make sure that my hormone levels are balanced, that my vitamin D levels are balanced, my cholesterol is healthy, my iron stores are healthy, my organs are functioning, just basic blood work that I always get to ensure my optimal health. It's also important that I'm very aware of my monthly cycles and that it's regular and that I'm not missing my periods and that I'm ovulating and that I don't experience PMS or symptoms associated with my period. All of this information helps really to reflect on my overall health and it really ensures that my body is, is fertile and ready to have children when I decide it's time. And I also make sure that I'm getting my annual pap smears and that the health of my cervix and the health of my body is, is optimal and functioning properly. And so really by visiting your doctor, staying in tune with your body, it's really essential in staying proactive in your health and the health of your babies. I really encourage you guys to take action with that and find a doctor that you're really committed to seeing on, a, on at least an annual basis. Okay, so we just went over the five commitments of overall optimal health to ensure your health and you to ensure then your baby's optimal health. And at this point, you may feel overwhelmed, you may feel empowered, you may feel inspired, whatever arises for you. Really, the take-home message that I really want to impart for you guys is to realize that the choices that you make on a day-to-day -day basis truly impacts not only your health, but the health of your future babies and the future generation of, of our society. And that's really empowering. That's really just so fun, I think, of great information to really, really take control of your own health. And so I just want you to make mindful choices. Now, this information was geared for women interested in having babies one day. But this information is also very applicable for our men out there, our, our women already pregnant, for those women who are breastfeeding right now, and for mothers in all stages of, of the stages of their children's life right now. So there's no better time than right now to be proactive with your health. And I just say have fun with the journey and make it fun because you'll feel better and really in the end all your children will thank you. So I have one request of you guys before we wrap up and that is please share these videos with at least five people you know that this information can really make an impact on them and their future babies. because. We all can contribute to society in some way, and by making the decisions with the, the education, the awareness, you really have the power now to contribute to others and really empower them to be able to choose these kind of lifestyle choices to really make this generation um, just so healthy and so alive. My commitment is to make sure that this future generation is far healthier than they are right now, and so your contribution to share these videos will really help that commitment, so thank you for that ahead of time. So, so exciting. Now, go make some cute babies and enjoy this journey of health. And I look forward to seeing you guys all in the next videos that come up for me. All right. Thank you again for your time and see you next time.